Like, what a Warcraft. Oh, but we're getting uh, live with the game, thank God. Yeah. <laughs> it's Demon and Evil. This first map of the Grand Finals for the 10th Sunday Cup of the Spring Season. The last one before the finale. And we're off with Evil and Demon right here. And Evil's going to get that Lightning Gun side spawn, which has to be preferable for him as he spots Demon whisking on by below, picking up that red armor. Evil is uh, in a good position, I think. Oh! Bit of damage coming in there as he spots Demon below. And the demon is definitely in a lot of trouble as he gets completely electrocuted by evil there. And evil just... This is like a fight where it's completely on evil's terms. And he's so comfortable and happy with it. And demon cannot get caught in those situations. Another fight yeah. where evil is just like, oh, hello. And that's another kill. So quick 2-0 on Furious Heights. Demon has to slow it down. Let's consider that, that yeah. approach right now. He's Another trying, game. but I, Demon had some really nice plasma there as well. So uh, what what else could he be expected to do from the spawn? <laughs> yeah, he needs to try to slow things down, build his way up, get the weapons first, get some armors together, avoid Demon, uh, avoid evil as much as possible, and that's really the only play that he can he can go with. And here we have evil from below. Again, the classic situation, he wants to see which way will Demon go. Because he's fine with evil, uh, Demon taking one of these items, because he can hit the rail and then take the other one. So it's always a favorable position for evil, and that's the play that he made. And that's what you have to do, especially when both items are up. It's definitely uh, an opportunity for Demon, but evil connecting these rails makes Demon's life really, really, really hard. And here we have, of course, a defense coming on this red, and this situation for evil now he will take this red, make a play onto the defense of Mega, and after that, depending on how clean this fight goes, he will have the ability to just continually frag Demon. And Demon, so far, is making this a really, really good fight. What a, an awesome stand here from Demon. He deals so much damage to Evil. Evil has well. to fall back, surely. He's got 64 HP, and Demon is above. He is not showing himself, and Evil is railable right now. But he can hear Evil's rail. So. Oh, there it is! <laughs> he gets the rail! So what patient. a beautiful defense from Demon. Absolutely stunning stuff there from the Belgian. He misses the red armor pickup, but at least he hits the damage. And he does have, at the moment, some kind of weapon advantage. He knows that Evil does not have a lightning gun. This could be something that plays to his considerations as he tries to predict Evil. And as you can see there, Evil below the lightning gun position. And that's something that Demon didn't account for, but he could have known. He could have known that, so... Red picked up by Evil. And Demon gonna take away that Mega Health. So this could be favorable for Demon if he manages to get onto the yellow. But Evil's gonna stop that from happening. Oh, and a brilliant direct rocket there. And a rail follow-up from Demon. And Evil calls a timeout. Interesting. Hmm. Interesting. Um, I'm not... Prepare to fight. And Three, we're back in two. the game. Evil apologized. Yeah. No explanation necessary. That is very true. Evil is a man of few words. <laughs> but many Russian smileys. And Demon... Oh! I was about to say he's making his way back into the game. Yeah. But then Evil, with that clutch rail, is definitely coming back into this one. And... There, Demon gonna go for the evil play. And he gets it as well. It, that's a brilliant thing to do off the spawn. And oh no! Oh, he missed the rocket. Oh but evil's God. so low, but it doesn't matter because he's gonna get that mega. And um, Demon's gonna find himself on the back foot once again. He's left with the red, but evil's not gonna let him get it. He just steals it away from him and rockets him in the face and says no. <laughs> Takes the rail. <laughs> yeah. It's really, really tough. He has to be absolutely gutted from that exchange. And it's so unfortunate. But Evil up the jump pad, misses the rail shot. And that's going to be able to let him, our uh, demon, onto more damage onto this red. Or maybe even a dive. And in fact, he's going to go for it. And that's going to be quite interesting now. Because if he can get his way over to Mega quickly enough, he will be able to potentially kill Evil or maybe steal the Mega. And that's going to set him up for a comeback if he can do it well, if he can execute. But got to remember, Evil has the opportunity to execute as well. He could hit loads of rails in a row. Here, there's one. That's all he's going to get. Brilliant from Demon. Oh, and he pushes Evil off. And Demon goes in for it. But Evil with the perfect LG engagement of five points of health left. Picks up 
that red armor, that 25, the next one as well, and he's slowly stacking back up, and oh my god, even if he watches this game back, yeah. he is going to be so gutted. Yeah, yeah, and you know, just like that, Evil's back up with the stack, but uh, Demon attacking anyway, he's really low, and Evil is able to take that kill. Mega is about to spawn any moment. Evil pretty much has, he knows that Demon can't take it, so he just tries to look for him, but uh, didn't really see him. Demon is doing a good job of hiding himself. He needs to. He, he doesn't want Evil to have any more frags, and he needs to keep the scoreline as tight as possible because there is only five minutes remaining. But after all, it is the first map in a best of five series, and these players are still feeling each other out. And, um, yeah. Trying to find each other's strengths and weaknesses. Really nice play there. They're, they're at the red yeah. by Demon. He manages to take it with just one point of health. And that's where you see the tables turned on the lock. Because yeah. at the last red, that's what happened for Evil. And um, he can do it too. Exactly. Now, Evil's kind of in a horrible spot, a precarious position to be defending from. And he does have. Oh! Oh! oh another one straight <laughs> to the face. Demon <laughs> is angry with that. That is not cool from Evil. Two, oh my god, and he yeah. hits the rail though, but one plasma yeah. bolt ends his life here. Yeah. He is living on the edge, literally there. He is so angry. <laughs> yeah, that would be absolutely raging. Evil's, oh, he picks up the 50, wow. great rocket damage. My excellent god. dodging, excellent rocket damage. I mean, that rage probably worked in his advantage just now. <laughs> I mean, he's going to get the mega. Bring himself back up to 100. It is certainly not over for Demon. As he's looking for evil. But can't find him at the moment. Yeah. It's definitely really tough for him now. As time is waning. Three and a half minutes left. And my god, he's had so many good opportunities. But evil has had so many incredible <laughs> escapes. Yeah. It's just insane, actually. Yeah, those rockets. Oh. And Demon coming onto the red again. He misses the first two rockets. Against a player of Evil's caliber, that's something that you, is very hard to come back from in the fight. But he manages to Whoa. do really well, actually, as Evil oh. makes a mistake as well, but 9 now. <laughs> Evil, oh. oh god, Demon, if you, I, I'm going to be really sad. Demon, when you rewatch this, don't feel bad. <laughs> I know you're feeling bad right now rewatching this VOD, but I'm, I'm sorry, man. It happens. Yeah, it's luck. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so there's our little message to Demon <laughs> in the future. <laughs> <Yeah>. And uh, <laughs> seven frags of difference now with three minutes left and Demon is still trying his best, but it's just looking harder and harder now as time goes on. And it is. Evil is uh, in the toxic spot and he moves away from it. And we'll find that this choke point is contested and it's not going to be easy to walk past. And of course, Demon is there <laughs> because he wants to defend or rather ward Evil away from the Mega. And if he locks out that choke point, then he gets the Mega un unharassed, and that's what he wants. And he gets onto the red armor, and there is... Oh, oh hello. Connection interrupted. Evil is going to be Whoa. so mad about that. That's uh, so strange. He couldn't have helped it, but in yeah. the end, I mean, Demon really did have a lot of damage, but of course, maybe yeah, he, he could have got was, away. He was dead, yeah. no matter what. Yeah. yeah. Um, so six frags of difference now, two minutes left. Something that Demon can, can make happen if he connects with his shots. It's uh, definitely a pressure situation, big pressure to connect. And it's something you, when you're in that situation as a player, you can't think about it. You can just think about, like you, you can never think about the pressure or hitting the shot. You just no. have a play and you try and execute and that's it, it's normal. You, you can't think about the context, but there you go. Uh, Evil oh. timed out and the match was forfeited. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so there was how long left? Well, two about minutes, two minutes. Two minutes when that happened. And it's six frag lead. Yeah. Six so this is a situation where we need to talk to the admins because... I believe so, yes. Yeah, so... It um, wasn't over. Demon does not want to give up. It's clear from, from what he just wrote. He said, well, that sucks. I think he assumed that he would have yeah. to take the loss, but I don't think that's very fair. So um, I, uh, GDK is just going to check up uh, yeah. with an admin about that right now, and uh, I guess we'll wait and see. See yeah, what, what the I final really verdict is. Exactly. That's a strange... I haven't we haven't come across a situation like that. No, I well, so far. Uh, remember that one, I think it was a, uh, an ESL event, and then there was oh that God. power cut, and then they made everyone on a T4, I don't know, the <laughs> Vertical Vengeance, I think? Yeah. Um, 
yeah, they made everyone like take all the items and get the timings totally yeah. perfect. I mean, that's a really nice thing to do, but I, I'm not too sure if we can do it in this situation. And then, yeah, the admin's calling uh, that we play the last two minutes and 20 seconds of the match. Okay. But to do that, we'll ha I'm assuming that we have to recreate the stacks and stuff like that to make it fair. Yeah, that's and exactly what Dimon just said. He, yeah. you know, Evil was on 40 HP. Er. He, yeah, he was dead basically. Yeah. So. Yeah. I guess that means evil fresh off the spawn and demon. What did he have? Like I don't know. I guess it, it's going to be between the admins and the players. We'll find out. And um, let's have a look. Uh, demon is just saying that he should get the same yeah. HP. That he he wants to uh, play it out in terms of making it yep. the last two minutes not fresh off the spawn. Yeah. So picking up from where they left off. Yep. And so. <laughs> Evil stays AFK yeah. <laughs> for 20 seconds. Yeah, I'm trying to sort, sort out whether it's wise to like go for a quick break because I know you guys don't want to be s sitting here like hanging around. Yeah, we're like whilst, typing whilst we're sorting everything out because it might take a little bit bit of a setup if we are to replay it. But then it depends on the players. Yeah. Because if they really want to do that, because they're deciding right now whether they want to do that. Um, uh. It looks like Evil is happy to do it as well. No, Evil uh, seems no? to want to not start from where they left off. He wants to start with a six frag lead and fresh spawns. Uh, Demon's claiming it's impossible, but okay. And uh, apparently it's going to happen, but hmm. um, Evil actually has to go AFK for 20 seconds when it starts. Yeah, I guess so that Demon can pick everything up. I don't know, it's pretty weird. To me, it's like... Oh, okay, yeah. I, I should I should think twenty that seconds. That's a lot in the last two minutes. I, I mean, I, I I don't know. That's four spawn frags. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I'm not sure how much they thought that through. <laughs> okay, so we won't go to break or anything, but yeah, this is a very strange situation. I mean, this happens sometimes. It's always so annoying. This is this is the. Do you, do you know um in Texas used to have a speech. For stuff like this. Really? I think it's like the vehicle of technology. <laughs> this speech. Was like, um. I don't know. I don't know what his speech was, but the gist of it was like yeah. the vehicle of technology ha has issues like this sometimes. Yeah. Well, the stuff can break. Yeah. I don't know, something like that. Exactly. Basically, you can have these technical issues when you're using technology, relying upon it. And you're not relying upon, I guess, a guy like let's say holding a tennis racket. Yeah. Like on like a court. Yeah. It's not like the net or something will just no. like disappear or. <laughs> something weird like that, or like someone starts lagging, just freezes. Maybe that might happen once we finally get quantum internet, but... <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Gonna have to wait a few more years for that. Yeah. Uh, what, what technical development are you, lo or technological development are you most looking forward to? Oh, I don't know. I'm thinking like maybe teleportation. That's going to be really cool. Where would um, you teleport to? How would you use it? Well, I mean, I tr travel like everywhere pretty much. I, okay. you know, then I could finally go home for a weekend <laughs> and not have to spend... But here we go. The game is getting underway. They're playing 2 minutes and 20 seconds, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. And it's a 6, six frag advantage, right? So for uh, For... Evil. Yes, so and evil is not doing the 20 second AFK, yeah. uh, like they said. Yeah, this might be. Face it is saying dot dot dot, so or yeah. admins, I guess. So, um, perhaps. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So here we are. It looks like uh, evil kind of ignored what the admin said. Yeah, but it doesn't matter because Demon got the frag. Um, probably feels like he deserved it. Uh, yeah. In terms of his performance, and he gets the rail. Excellent. And then Reg is spawning right now, so he has to hit the shots. He yeah. does. So it's only four frags now in a, a minute and 30 seconds or so that he has to get. Yeah, indeed. O only four frags. <laughs> it's like not too much. Right? Against evil. <laughs> and he has to go aggressive. He's going aggressive. He's Whoa. gonna maybe pick it up. Oh, but he has to retreat there. Yeah. He hits the rail and misses a second. That looked like it went through his legs or something, but he yeah. does pick up the frag. Brilliant stuff from Demon here. Finds Evil off the spawn, but misses the shot. He's screaming, and Evil's going to just take him down with a machine gun. And, yeah. He's not happy about that. And okay. Yeah. So, so Inz is, uh, as the admin is calling, uh, is calling Demon to win this map, regardless of the outcome of the game. Oh, because, because Evil did not do the two minute. Because he didn't listen to. Yeah, or the, the 20 second say. AFK. Yeah. Well, yeah, but I thought. It, it's 20 second was kind of extreme with the small time limit, but he didn't yeah. do anything. In I mean, he just played normally, so that's really just. In the grand scheme of things, it's not like really. The implications aren't really that huge because 
both of these players <laughs> will make the top eight of the finale next week. So yes, they both that's will. True. That's like a, a certainty. That's true. That's true. I guess all we really saw, I mean, a just a display of uh, bad sportsmanship. Yeah, and it could just be something that's, I don't know. I was about to say lost in translation, oh, yeah, but could maybe, have been. maybe I don't. I don't know. But I, I saw them I repeating so. it so many times and okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> AFK 20 seconds, okay. Yeah, so interesting stuff here on Face It TV. Yep. Um, I guess the match is going to be over now, but Demon will want win anyway, which I think is a pretty interesting yeah. result. He, he <laughs> doesn't mean, know it though. Yeah, he doesn't know it. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess uh, Inz is going to speak to them now. Yeah. Our trusty, faithful admin. Yeah. Scolding He's evil a little bit. Demon wins this map. Inn's doing all kinds of good work for us here at Face It. And of course, guys, we have the North American Cup coming up after this grand final. So don't go anywhere after this one finishes. Of course, if you want to see players such as Rafa and De Hang battling it out in the grand final again, because usually that's what happens. It's happened every single time and either one has played. Rafa versus De Hang is always a fun match. It is, yeah. It's, it's pretty good. You but can throw zero 4 in there as well. And uh, good matches were had. Destruct. Are we going to... Destruct hasn't See been seen. He's not. He's not played a single one. All right. Well, I'm gonna have to look at the sign-up list for the North American uh, tournament shortly after this. But yeah, uh, we're at the Europeans now, and we're just about to start the second map. It's gonna be Campgrounds. So Demon has won the first map by default uh, due to drama, <laughs> <laughs> and um, yeah, and so he's gonna start this best of five uh, second map. One it's campgrounds, yeah. This is going to be pretty damn good for Demon because, um, and also like I don't know how this can psychologically affect the players because they just had this weird situation, and it's yeah. like it, it, you want stuff to be simple. You want to sit down and play Quake. Yeah. You don't have to think about oh he didn't deserve that win or I didn't deserve that win or whatever. But the game is getting live. It's going underway here. Campgrounds is map number two, and I don't I don't know if the players know, but Demon is uh, actually a map ahead here. It is best of five, and Demon gets the lightning gun and the Mega Spawn, which is my favorite here on this map. And Evil is be spotted below, and he gets some nice damage, but Demon is going to get the Railgun here. So that's going to be a decisive advantage that he'll have coming into the next big items. And here we go, he's going to go for the defense of the red. And here is Evil. E oh, and this uh -huh. is terrible for Evil. Oh my god, his damage! Wow. How? How? I mean, like, at the start of that fight, Demon got a free 50 damage yeah, or something. Yeah, yeah. Evil was not ready for that. He did not expect Demon to, to know that he was there. And wow, he really turned that around with his really good aim. And he's able to win the Mega and the Yellow from that. And he has everything. And Demon now has nothing. And it's also uh, one of those situations where if you look at what Demon was doing, he was hiding below the, the uh, what's it called? the yellow armor <laughs> to deal that damage as yeah. Demon went for the railgun yeah. and then he went and eliminated the rail as a possibility by attacking low so that damage output hit that he'd done and that was basically the trade for demon to have the rail advantage was then nullified so it becomes yeah. an advantage of evil if he takes that fight and his aim is so good that even in the angle is not really a problem for him so then he went that's one of the reasons why he won that engagement so it's really really smart from evil to go for players like that yeah so really nice statistically he probably shouldn't have but it happened I mean that's how that's the edge that uh, such nice aim can give you in clutch situations, for sure. And for sure. And quick 4-0 lead here for Evil before the first two minutes are over. Um, it's looking He's looking really strong right now, and Demon must be a bit frustrated. He had a nice start, but um, yeah, uh, I think Evil outsmarted him at that point. Yeah, it's, it's something that can happen. I mean, this is all about campgrounds. It's, it's just the way that it works. You're in control, and it's ha about how well you use the control. And because you can really get a lot out of it, it's really, yeah. really difficult sometimes for the guy out of control. And it's why it's so awesome to watch the really, really top level players play out of control because it, it, they make it look easy. Yeah. They don't die somehow. I mean, and talks it's made it look easy. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's so difficult to do this properly yeah. and right. survive. Because the guy on the, on the other side with control, he gets a good 15 seconds to just hunt you down regardless of positioning. He just can chase you down and catch you with all kinds of damage. And there's not much health and armor for you to take on the map. So if you take any damage, you get to these critical situations and becoming a ghost is very hard indeed. And last weekend we saw Rafa do it amazingly well. And there is a drop from onto Eel's head by a demon there. What a strange 
encounter they just had there. Damon's missing his rails so far though, so... Oh, Evil catches him hiding around a corner. Demon is not able to connect with many rockets at all, giving Evil a 5-0 lead. Uh, he's pretty comfortable right now, but it's, you can see that Demon is taking the upper positions, uh, which uh, el enables him to drop down rockets and rail to Evil, but Evil doesn't seem to care. He just uh, plays with whatever weapon best suits the situation and utilizes that better than what Demon is doing. Yeah, definitely. It's Again, it's uh, Demon's basically playing for the five-minute mark to basically reverse control by then, and if he can engineer some kind of crazy situation that allows for that he's going to be happy otherwise it's he should be comfortable that if he keeps the score around this around eight nine frags lost that and he gets to that point around five minutes he can be happy and he can have a chance at winning this game but otherwise it's very 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 difficult i would say and he's going to drop on the mega and there you go that was the opportunity demon managed to steal away a red because they're both spawning at the same time yeah. And Evil is going to lose out positioning on yellow. But the thing is, is that Demon does not have weapons. This is a very difficult thing about this map. And one of the reasons why, if you do, if you do die, and why it can be so bad out of control, you lose the weapons. Yeah. And the, the rocket, lightning, gun umbrella are so separated. But here comes the engagement. And ouch, Demon does go down there. But yeah, the railgun, rocket, and lightning gun just come so far apart. I think Demon is kind of giving this one up. Maybe. I mean, he's 9 to minus 1 now, pulling out the pummel. pummel. And uh, I wonder if his head is a little bit out of the game due yeah. to some of the issues that we had. And uh, yeah. Yeah, a quick forfeit there from Demon. So we're not even going to reach the five minute mark, I think, um, or just past it. But so we're going to go move on to map three. So yeah. one apiece. So number three. technically, it's just a best of three now. <laughs> yeah. And uh, I think map number three, you mentioned it was going to be Hectic or Arrow Walk. I'm just checking, double checking. Let's have a look. Uh, da, 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 da. Yes, it's going to be Airwalk actually. All right. So Airwalk Toxicity and Lost World. Yeah. So Airwalk, um, <laughs> Demon's we not had a good track record on this today so far. Not today. We uh, Ash, anyway. watched him get destroyed by Ash. But exactly. Perhaps he um, he's been able to just brush it off. It's a new Russian. A new <laughs> Russian. <laughs> And a uh, totally new opponent, and um, it, you know, new spawns, new everything. So, yeah. and remember that Demon is this is actually one one right now because yeah. Demon basically got a forfeit win on the first map due to the the weirdness of the situation. And he, he just found out about that, and he's like, "What the hell?" He didn't realize. <laughs> he didn't know. Oh, <laughs> oh my goodness! So he evil played campgrounds thinking he was two up. Yeah. So this is a great way to mess with the minds of the players. Wow. But it's, as a player, the way you should be in this situation is this is a mental test of my, my mental fortitude. Yeah, it's yeah. Like I must maintain my composure as a player. Well, if you think like that and you understand it, you know, as, as the situation being in that way, like as a test, like it's only a test. Uh, apparently, research actually shows that um, by recognizing that you know that, uh, you're less susceptible to the actual effects of that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah I think that's really true. Because you kind of let go. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Exactly, and you you uh, kind of you know zoom out of of the situation. So yeah, uh, I'm not sure though if Evil knows about that. <laughs> We're yeah. gonna see. I think I guess he's a little bit uh, angry. I'm not, they're not readying up yet. He's um, still typing, I think, with the admins. Yeah. Uh, but I'm not too sure what happened there. I perhaps he just didn't understand the AFK for 20 seconds. Um, I don't know. I think he actually said no, but basically the admin had told him that's how it's gonna be. Yeah. And he and was he like, just no. Ignored. <laughs> I think I think that's what happened. Yeah, okay. he just ignored it. I think so. That's kind of the situation, more or less. So, uh, yeah. So I guess evil is. Uh, that's the reason for the hold up because evil is like, perhaps. He's he's typing. I think I don't really know exactly okay. what evil's doing. Well, uh, while we're but waiting for these guys to sort it out, um, you might as well just mention that next week it's going to be the finals. And who are we looking at that are going that are going to play uh, during that yeah, we have momentous uh, occasion? <laughs> well, of course, we at, at the start of the season we had of course Cooler, who basically just came alive and he's like, "Hey guys, <laughs> hey guys, I still play this game <laughs> and I'm still really, really good." Yeah. And he managed to get loads and loads of points. And I can just pull out the points here. I'm just pulling them up. So we have Cooler with 118 points, 
So wow. he's got he's got a lot of points, <laughs> kind of in Eeyore's position from last time. Yeah. And we have Pavel on number on the second spot. And although Pavel hasn't really won, I think he's won actually. Maybe he did win. Yeah, I think he's won. A spring cup. I'm not sure. Maybe won. But he always gets deep. He always yeah. gets so far. Then you dare. <laughs> he always gets so deep in these tournaments. And we have Demon on the third spot, who was, again, a player like Pavel in that way. Yeah. But he's yeah. actually made yep. victories as well. Yeah. Agent as well, number four spot. We've got Pony on the, on the fifth spot. Matrox on number six. Yep. Evil on number seven. And Guard on number eight. So Okay, so we've so got Guard there. That's who Twister was trying to edge out today. Yeah, exactly. But I think that Cypher might be able to get there because he's got two accounts and oh he's got different yeah. points in different accounts so we have to, we'd have to add everything up but yeah. basically that's how the top eight stands at the moment and so there's a bit of a dispute going on at the moment and is trying to sort it out yeah and so we can get this game underway and we're kind of at the third map stage we're on air walk and between evil and demon and of course after this guys we have the north american cup we're actually running relatively quickly today because the north american stuff start cup starts in 40 minutes mm -hmm. so well yeah. time flies when you're having fun and we've had Amazing, amazing games today, and I hope that all of you guys have enjoyed the action at home. We've seen lovely, lovely play yeah. from Ash, from Tox. Yeah, Toxic is definitely a highlight. For yeah, sure. yeah, Toxic is always a, a highlight, always a mentionable, and uh, of course Pony. That the that game was just great. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, time time's been flying, and it's it's great, and I hope that the North American League can also. Uh, or sorry, Spring Cup, or is it a league, or is it a cup, or? Yeah, I mean, we have, of course, the guy with the most points comes over to yeah. Milan for the season finale, so that's going to be great, which is next week. Yeah. And we have Zero Four, who's actually checked in already. Yeah. And who else? Who are the Nozzles? We have De Hang, of course, and Rafa, all the three most important players, the three best players checked in. Do we see Chance, though? He was here a few times. Oh, Chance yeah. is still playing. Yeah, he's, he's really he's really good still. You can see you can see the rust when he's playing. Yeah. But, but still Chance is quite a beast. Yeah. And you can see like how smart he is because he's he is. that's really what it is about with his game, I think. Just he's just smart. He's like, a thinker, yeah. He is a thinker. <laughs> Curse those thinkers. <laughs> CZM. CZM yeah. CZM's a thinker. I think Quake attracts thinkers, though. If you think about it, I mean, what is the ratio of PhDs among the, the top Quake yeah. players? <laughs> or not just top, but at least enthusiastic yeah. Quake players. Uh, I, I assume it's probably higher than the ratio of PhDs yeah, in the I, top Counter-Strike like players. <laughs> I think I know, know at least four or five PhDs in, in the Quake scene. That's I, probably I know one amazing. that you don't know, actually. That uh, I didn't mention. Um, mm. He's a friend of uh, Fuki and, uh, and uh, Tibble. His name is uh, Hoens, he's American. Uh, he's got a, a PhD as well. Really? Yeah. In what? Um, in data mining, something to do with data mining, computer science and data mining was they a specialty. Should, everyone should just like get yeah. together <laughs> and just be a think tank about Quake. Yeah. <laughs> so, so basically, Evil kind of like disappeared. He's on the <laughs> server, always, always come back now. He's, I thought for, we thought for a moment that he's just gone. Yeah. He's just like left. He's I like, think he just this. went to smoke, yeah. <laughs> yeah, get rid of the stress. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, but they're still they uh, they haven't sort of they haven't come to a consensus. I think um, Evil belie believes it's really unfair, and I don't think he ever agreed. And um, the admins yeah. believe it's fair. So apparently, it is, yeah, it's Evil's call, so. well, <laughs> Evil's not accepting that. So we're gonna have to see how this yeah. is gonna progress. Um, it's, yeah, I think it's a situation where you are, you it d yeah admins call is is everything. Well, yeah, so I mean, that's why be, there's an admin. Yeah, yeah, as it should be. So, I mean, <laughs> Demon has to either, uh, Evil has to either go okay or I don't know what else his options are, just not play or uh, something. I guess, but... In the middle of a grand final. We've um. had it before where we had Strengths and I think Pavel and basically the situation was that Demon had just lost a very, very close game to Pavel and uh, Strengths and Pavel couldn't find a server. And the way that the rules worked w would force the server, so there would be like a, a, a disadvantage, I think, for uh, strengths. Oh, I yeah. It, was it Pavel? Pavel, I think it was. Yeah, it was Pavel, I think. And yeah, it was Pavel because strengths won that weekend. And so then Pavel was like, I'm not going to play. And then we put Demon in the grand final, but at least it hadn't started yet. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. So like exactly. now we have a situation where exactly. we've already gone underway. So um, it actually turns out so. Coke, Cook, Coke. It's Coke. Uh, cookie. Co cookie. 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 Oh, cute. Cookie. Okay, Cookie. cookie yeah. yeah, the uh, the admin or the what manager, I guess, of uh, 102. Um, he's, yeah, he's here to translate. Yeah, he's here to translate. Yes. So apparently, uh, apparently, evil is pulling the Russian card. <laughs> <laughs> And Evil it is actually suggesting that they play T7 all over again, and 
and says that is definitely not happening. And I, I agree with that. That should not happen. Mm. Um, but uh, apparently, evil indeed did not understand that he shouldn't move. Okay. What to do? Yeah. <laughs> I guess. I guess. Yeah. I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I. I. Ins knows all the players really well, so I feel like Ins should should like know whether Evil would have understood him or not. And uh, Evil Evil does understand some English, so well but maybe not enough. I I think the admins did make a reasonable effort to make sure that Evil understood. They repeated themselves a lot. I mean, you yeah, can see it on yeah. uh, the server logs at least. Um, so if Evil didn't understand because it was with a question mark at the end. So obviously they were asking him something, and he actually wrote okay. So I mean, if yeah, he didn't understand, thing, yeah. he should have said something. I mean, that doesn't this this doesn't really make any sense. Yeah, to it me. makes it makes it very hard when there's I mean, there's there's issues that basically like play to the advantage of one player to the other, and then there's like oh wait, let's add on communication issues because uh, we have someone who doesn't really speak English at the same time. So that's like makes it even more complicated and annoying yeah. for everyone involved. Yeah, and so. Yeah, it's it's okay though. I mean, like we have so many smooth tournaments. The yeah. Sunday Cup usually like from start to finish. It's like no delays. It's like super smooth. Great games. Great players. So having as having some something like this every once in a while is is not too too much. I mean, I remember the the early days of the Sunday Cups. We would have a lot of issues, and there was a lot of uh, issues also with people just readying up without like being re waiting for the stream but now like everyone understands you yeah. wait for the stream and like it's all a smooth process everyone understands that yeah it works now yeah yeah but it uh it makes sense i mean i also think that the other players really enjoy to watch their competitors or their upcoming competitors uh games through the stream as well if they're not playing at the same time uh, it's very advantageous obviously to to be able yeah. to see how your opponents play and i know that uh, this information really <laughs> A lot of you don't want to hear it, but I do know that there are some viewers that don't know anything about Quake, so sometimes it just helps to rehash everything to its basics, just yeah. to clarify the game, just in case. And they're actually getting underway here, it looks like. They're both ready, so I guess we're going ahead with this. And uh, Okay, so here we are, Evil and Demon now, and... I guess we're still at a 1-1 situation then, and there's a quick rocket onto Evil. Oh, but Demon misses the rail follow-up. That is pretty pretty brutal there, and Evil's going to walk away with a stack advantage going into this one. Mm. And We've got everything, the yellow as well, but Demon manages to get one rail. He doesn't connect with the next. And there's some pressure applied by the grenades of Evil, but it won't deter Demon from the pickup. And here comes Evil with the lightning gun and all that damage will be enough to take Demon down. See, Demon falls, but with the aggression of the shotgun, pulling out the Dahang, he may well just do it, but 25 health for him, surely. Oh, oh there it is, the shotgun. It can be so useful in Duel if you know how to use it, and Demon shows you just how. And he does remedy his problems in the short term at the very least. Oh, that oh. great rocket bounce. Does take a direct to the face. Oh, another one. And wow, Demon typing a little bit again. <laughs> Cannot show signs of frustration. Got to keep composed there. Yeah, but yeah. But I mean, I was surprised he took the first direct. And I was like, okay, you know, it's fine. He yeah. Get, he'll get the kill now. Yeah, but the second the was yeah. great. So Demon not happy with that. The Demon is angry. Right, but is he angry? at least it's just a one frag margin as we're entering one and a half minute mark. When we saw Demon play this against Ash earlier, that was not the case. Yeah, and Demon right now has got Evil down to a low stack. He's going to do a, a sneaky drop, and he's going to catch Evil off guard. But can he execute? He has to make it work with the lightning gun with the rockets. Oh, but Evil with the fade away rail shot ends the life of Demon there. And that was another frag that should really have been Demon's. So I hope he's not getting frustrated even more, because that can just end you. Got, and Evil is someone who has the psychological game under lock and key. Demon with some good damage. And Evil with the prediction to win another frag. And he's going to be in time for the yellow. If he, Man, if he gets a clean yellow hit and manages to frag or Ooh. hit rails like that across the map on his way over to red armor, he could take, like, cycle everything. And if you get to that spot, like, okay, now he gets the red armor, surely. Or, well, he gets, goes to the quick pressure first, but gets the red armor. 
He's going to get the health. He's going to have good positioning and for a defense in the Mega. And maybe even get time for the yellow. Get there in time for the yellow. I'm not sure. The yellow is quite close to Mega. But Demon's on the wrong side. Oh, Demon with brilliant timing. Key play from the, uh, the bell. So important to stop that cycle from Evil, who was trying to build towards it. And now Demon can bring himself back in this game. And that shows you exactly why. To the second timing is so crucial. And how much it can help you. Yeah, exactly. We saw that's where Puri really fell down in his match against Ash earlier today. And Demon is definitely using that tactic now against Evil. He needs to make up for three frags. It's so easy on this map. But Evil just charging with the LG. Um, he's not letting Demon get any closer to his lead. And the Demon approaches Evil under all the pressure there. 25 is there to help him out. And he's not feeling so bad anymore. And Demon, though, still applying the pressure. He's got low, very, very low health. And Evil knows it goes straight down for the frag. Demon misses the rail to stop him on the way. And that is what really, really secured Evil that frag. Oh, the rocket damage so much. And Demon gets the frag. Yeah. But he is so low for it. And just a one machine gun bullet, that's going to finish him off. So uh, in the end... That frag did not do much for Demon. I uh, know, uh, that can be the way of Eric, I guess, sometimes. And Evil is experiencing, again, some more pressure. But look at that, under pressure connects <laughs> to the forehead of Demon as he just tries to maintain this position over at red. But now, now he'll do it, and he'll get the red this time. So another trade of frags. And Demon going to get another one off the spawn, perhaps. There you go. And he could even consider getting a rocket jump up to that railgun now. now but actually, Evil will be in the spot to stop any, any shenanigans uh, like that and we have the mega coming up as well as the red very soon and evil isn't going to go for position he's going to get weeded out there of that area of the rocket area and that can be so dangerous if you have someone sitting there with a rel and demon's going to be able to defend this mega there's the pickup got to pressure the red gets a little bit of damage there not quite enough with the lg demon is definitely doing okay but he should be having a bigger output of damage right now, I think, to feel comfortable in bringing this one back. Evil's managed to pick up a lot, and there comes a quick little skirmish between the two as Demon moves his way onto position. Oh, that red misses the connection of that rail off of the bounce of the rocket. And there is Demon with another red pickup. Five minutes into this one now, and Demon coming on to the attack of the Mega. There's Evil for the defense. Whoa. He makes it happen. 13 points so low. He does it again. Demon this just guy. says, K, why does he keep communicating? Just stay in the game, Demon. Sorry, I'm getting a little bit carried away here, but uh, Demon is being really aggressive. He's showing his frustration to Evil, and Evil is just taking a step back and saying, then, okay, come to me, and I'll just rail you and rocket you in the face and punish you for it. Yeah, actually, it's a good point, you know, because this helps Evil. He was like, yeah, you better be raging. It's like, oh, you're raging, huh? <laughs> and it's like, he's, he's liking it. It's like really yeah, helpful for exactly. his mental state. Oh, definitely. It's like, I'm doing it right. Exactly. I so mean, all that does is just stroke his ego, ego even more. Yeah. So <laughs> with four minutes left, seven <laughs> frags of difference. Demon is looking at another death in yeah. the hands of the Russian yeah. evil. It's certainly still possible for him, though. But right now, he is really just throwing caution to the wind and attacking somewhat recklessly. So he needs to gain a little bit more composure, more stack, but evil is low. He's definitely railable. Beautiful. Excellent work from Demon. And now he has to follow it up with more. He is quite behind at this point, but recoverable it is as he tries to keep that pressure up, the Mega up on the spot again. He's really committing for a lot of damage. That rock is so key, and he picks up the Mega, but misses that rail oh. and the second, and that will be his death. But he was on four points of health. He didn't even need to shoot a rail. Oh, man, but at least Demon knows he's screaming now, but he has the Railgun out. Again, he just, just anything will kill Demon, Twenty, uh, will kill Evil. But yeah. now he picks up the health and... He can actually survive on rail, and uh, that confidence gave him... Uh, that knowledge gave him the confidence to put himself out there and rail Demon twice. And now he got him himself another two frags. And De Demon's not looking like the Demon from before, like the, the confident aiming, the... No, he's flustered and he's typing. Um, yeah. Just chill, Demon. Chill. Yeah, he's... he's uh, <laughs> hey there. I just was watching him and he was just spinning around oh and then shot himself. No. So it looks like this map is going, it's just forfeit at this point. Yeah. And as Demon has to refocus, he's got the win on Furious Heights, I still, I believe. So, I, I and that's going to mean that now it's going to be a 1-2 scoreline. Yeah, and in Evil's mind, chance. it's 3 now. 
Yeah. <laughs> But uh, yeah, so then all the pressure will be on Demon for the next map if he doesn't win it. He is out, although he has secured his place in the finals yeah. now. This is a matter of pride. It is a matter of pride. Demon, he needs to focus. He can't let what's been and what is to be be in his mind. It must be all about the moment, the present. He should take meditation classes. <laughs> Learn to be in the moment. Well, maybe his name is just, uh, you know, he's becoming his name. And uh, <laughs> he shouldn't uh, think about that. But now I'm just talking BS here as we're trying to fill in the last two minutes of the game. It's really clear that Evil has won. I know that everyone hates it when you call games beforehand, but I'm just saying what everyone knows. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's better to recognize it and then talk about other stuff than, you know, oh my god, 50 frags in one and a half minutes, oh my god. Yeah, yeah, I mean, none of us <laughs> are DJ Weed, we just can't make this exciting, I'm sorry. Yeah. DJ Weed can make, like, breathing exciting, or yeah. like a sandwich, you know, making a sandwich. Like, oh my god, he's spreading the butter, <laughs> <laughs> look at those even strokes. <laughs> That's awesome. Sounds like he's done this before. Like, if you, if you like request this when you're in his presence. Oh, absolutely, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just that, get bored. That, like that's basically what I do. <laughs> <laughs> nice, nice. Sounds like a good sort of plan. But yeah, so basically we're going to move on to the next map. And that's going to be Toxicity. So that's going to be the territory of Demon to bring himself back mentally. Because after Toxicity, if he wins that, he'll be able to go to Lost World to try and win there. Yeah, and, and we've seen Demon play phenomenally on Lost World. When his uh, mental state was, was secure, Indeed. at least. <laughs> I, I mean, mean, he was really patient, though. He really he played that so nicely, that yeah. one, actually. I'm going to go back and watch that demo and learn a few things. <laughs> oh, <most laughs> definitely. And actually, guys, remember the North American Cup is starting in 30 minutes or so. And we have the usual suspects, Graf of the Hang 04, already checked in. And also remember, if you're a North American player or you're, or you're wanting to play Quake and you're, you know, in the North America and you've never played Quake before, you can sign up to the site and there's daily cups running for North America. So get yourself signed up to those, get some activity going, rejuvenate the American Jewel scene, yep. and be a part of something that can grow once again. Exactly. I mean, because we're seeing all this new European talent, so we've really, you know, embraced it on this side of the ocean. Uh, and now we need to see some up-and-comers that are going to be challenging Rafa and Dehang and Chance. And oh, that would uh, be crazy, wouldn't it? Yes. That'd yeah, that's crazy. what we need from, from the North American viewers. But uh, perhaps they just don't get up early enough to be able to watch the European games. So yeah, maybe, maybe that's true. Yeah. So, okay. So we're coming on to toxicity now. Mm -hmm. Demon needs to... Needs to sort out this this stuff in there. The headspace needs yeah. to uh, be cleaned. Maybe he should take up smoking. Oh no, he does smoke already. <laughs> oh no, he's screwed then. <laughs> yeah. He's already screwed. There's nowhere to turn. <laughs> oh my god. You shouldn't yeah. advocate smoking. No, I know. I just realized. So unhealthy. It's so terrible. It causes cancer and stuff like that. <laughs> uh. People die all the time. I mean, have you not read the warnings? Yeah, you know, in Australia, they actually print pictures of, like, diseased stuff. Oh but nice. we're going to get underway right now, and we see Evil here taking the Mega. And uh, so Damon, obviously, with the red. Yeah, Toxicity. Start. It's all about Demon's mindset right now. Oh, my wow. God. Great bounce, <laughs> but he can't finish it. Yeah. The, the easiest or the hardest rocket is to get the bounce, and then he just can't follow it up yeah. each time, unfortunately. Demon with the first frag, he needed it so much. Yeah. And he's going to drop onto the red. Two seconds left. Oh, it's a trade. Who gets the better spawn? Evil finds himself at the yellow. And he's got six seconds until Mega. So this is plenty of time for Demon to get his way around there for the attack. Oh, Demon Evil drops off by accident, I think. And he will get away. So it may be a blessing in disguise. Maybe. I mean, scoreline's tight right now, but... Demon is doing some really nice shaft damage. Evil is really low. He needs that help, but Demon is going to chase him. He does not want to let him get away. He's desperate to build up a lead, um, but Evil manages just to slip through his fingers. And yeah, it's always the story with these top players. They, they know how to be slippery. <laughs> and Evil right there is on the mid ranges taking a fight against Demon and with the rail switch yeah. it's not a problem and that's a tight game now 5 seconds till Mega this is another opportunity where if you have 
pinpoint timing. He can do this. Oh, oh and he misses the plasma. But still really nice from Demon. I mean, he's taken away all of Evil's Mega. Evil is going to retreat to the red, but uh, Demon manages to survive. Yep. How, is he low? Oh, no, he's not low. He's not so low. And this is, again, like a situation for Demon where he could be... Uh, this is a contested situation. And it can go either way on the control point of things. It's all about this position Demon has. He's got the better spot because he's got Mega side. And here you have height advantage. You can fall back onto Mega to damage fall back. He didn't manage to get any damage, but at least he did get the Mega nonetheless. Yeah. And you can see that Evil's in a worse spot. He's got less escape options than Demon. Demon can get more angles. He, but the thing is, is that Demon's not really executing right now. He's not hitting the shots. Not much damage output there for him. But positionally speaking, it was perfect. But the execution lacking in the last minute. And Evil... Whoa. Is he... Yeah. Ew. Evil had like a freeze he there. He again? Yeah, he had a freeze there for like two, uh, like two seconds. So obviously there's something going on with uh, Evil's connection. I mean, we saw that, uh, that quick uh, freeze as well on um, yeah. Furious Heights. Uh, but I mean, he let that one go. I, I guess that happens to everyone. We also saw it happen with uh, Puri. So, um, but with Evil, he timed out. Clearly there's something wrong, but he's ready to go again. Yeah, it's... Um, yeah, Prepare it's tough. To I was about to pause because I can actually Three, pause, but... Uh, oh, no, actually, I don't have admin now, I think, or I'm not sure, actually, but because I had to reconnect. But anyway, Evil came... Like, it was just a two-second lag. Like, it wasn't even a jerk. It was, like, freezing for two seconds and then unfreezing. Kind of weird. Yeah. Yeah. But here you have Evil defending this Mega, and he's in a terrible spot. This is Demon's Frag, and there you go. He takes wow. advantage. Oh, my goodness. He, Evil gets away with 18 points of health. 18, no way. There you go. Demon finishes off. it up. That's pretty crucial there. Yeah, definitely crucial, giving him the lead, but this game can't go back and forth as we see Evil taking the red there, but Demon is able to really punish him for it, trapping him in that little area with great rockets. Uh, Evil is for sure hurting, and Demon does not want him to grab those 250 health bubbles, so he catches him at the teleporter. Excellent work. Demon, yeah. Demon picks up the yellow. Two point lead. And there you go. Excellent. A brilliant rockets. series of rockets to gain himself one more frag on the board. And Evil has a couple rails to respond with. And Demon is here in this spot and he's like, he's too scared to move. And uh, is Evil's timing out again. Okay. Yep. And I can't pause, so I don't have the admin rights to pause. Uh, time out. Let's see if we can pause. Slash pause. Yeah. I need admin again, basically, and mm. to be able to pause. Oh my goodness, this finals is riddled with issues. Yeah. Riddled with issues. And not the issue that talks about farms. Because if we had loads of issues running around, that'd be awesome. I think everyone would love that. Yeah. I want to see more pictures with like random coolers in, in there amongst oh the farm man, animals. Oh man, drops. And issues, yeah. Oh my goodness, uh, this is not a good way to... Demon it. says it is annoying, and it indeed it is. I would say, though, with 3.45 in the map, uh, well, it was a very close game, 5 to 3, 5 to 2. 5 to 2, uh, I, that could be a restart, but that would be annoying if uh, Evil keeps on timing out again. Yeah, what to do in these situations? Mm -hmm. Like, this is pretty terrible. Mm -hmm. It's not ideal, not ideal. Well, this stuff happens Prepare from time to time. To I mean, what can you do? Three, two, the one, internet and all that. Fight. Evil usually doesn't have these issues either. No. And how how terrible is this for the players? For, you know, regardless of the viewers and us with like the production and us as like the cast is trying to fill the time and like figure out what's happening. But for the actual players, it's like you play this game and you're in, you're, you're focused, you're in the in the moment, in the mood, and so on. And then boom. Yeah. Oh, I'm not playing now? What's yeah. happening? Do I have to play again? Yeah, exactly. Like, I mean, what, because you're, you're so focused because you have to keep track of so many things. And I'm really sorry to reiterate basic information, but just to make it clear for those of you who don't know Quake Dueling so much, you have to keep track of so much. You need to know when all the power-ups are spawning, how much health your, your opponent has, you know, whether they're stacked, what weapons they have, where they are. If they're trying to trap you, you have to try to set up traps for them. You are so focused in just that short 10-minute uh, period that yeah. pauses like this. I mean, that's why they call them tactical timeouts in Team Deathmatch, because it really does just um, uh, take you out of the zone. Yeah, it's really hard to deal with. Really hard to deal with. So, 
<laughs> we're gonna have another situation where I think we're gonna try and play the remaining time with the score. Okay. Um, uh, from yeah. three forty onwards, five two. Okay. This is awkward. It's very awkward. <laughs> I Are you whispering about it? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what I'm whispering, but I find it to be pretty awkward because it's like, like we have to cast for a certain time and then add the frags and so on to the score. And I don't even know what frags they finish with. In fact, uh, it was five to two. Is it five to two? Yeah, I believe. Okay, uh, five to two, and they want to play from three minutes forty onwards okay. with that score line from what I read. I guess I mean that makes sense because um, that's what they did for uh, yeah, Furious Heights, even though Demon took that by weird. default, but. Yeah, it's it's hard because if it's like the first minute of the match, then well, players usually are fine. Yeah, we started like no matter like even if one guy got a better start. Yeah, people yeah. are usually fine. But yeah. if it's like almost four minutes you've yeah. played and it's like you have an advantage and yeah, throwing away that much time is is not preferable. No, like no, you really earned. Yeah. And an advantage. No, absolutely not. Uh, so I yeah. guess that, that that's what they're going to do. We see Evil coming back into the server now. Um, Russian internet. I mean, what, like, what kind of download speeds do you think they have? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> usually, I've never seen problems from Evil before. Yeah. It's usually just rooting, if Does it's anything. It's never like this. Uh, is Evil the one that like, lives in the middle of Pavel. nowhere? Ah, oh, it's Pavel. Okay. Yeah, Pavel is in some provinces. Uh, yeah. in, a, in a province somewhere. Like in Siberia? <laughs> <laughs> really, really far out. Really far out. Um, so we're just trying to see if our evil's doing, and yeah, that's more or less where we're at. So he's back on the server now, so hopefully we can get underway with this and find out whether or not he's able to actually play, and then if he can play, if he's okay with, we, we have to make sure he understands this time, like yeah. what's happening. Yeah, well so at we least cook yeah, cookies, cookies on the server. Yeah, yeah. cookies <laughs> there. He's there to save the day, yeah. so we're fine with that. Excellent, excellent. Uh, but you know, we're <laughs> just going to have to wait and see. And uh, just uh, while we're waiting, don't forget, after this, we do have the North American Dual Cup coming up for their Sunday. And we are going to see greats like Rafa and Dehang. And yep. uh, let's see. Oh, Ray, Wonko, 04 as well. So that's great. Yep. It's always nice to old school players back there. I think the first time I met 04 was like 2004. But they are going to get back into the game. Uh, I believe that they are just going to play Three, from 340 two. onwards with yeah. a scoreline of 5 to 2. And we see Demon getting the red spawn. Okay. Here oh. we go. Evil pushing in. Really aggressive. That health bubble really helped him, but Demon still got the kill in the end. Exchanging 1-1. One, one. Evil comes out on top with the mega, but... Demon doing great lightning gun damage. Really, really, really nice. Um, and Evil yep. is hurting a lot. And we have to remind ourselves to add three to the score of Demon. Yes. Because he's three up. So, yeah. so it's actually four to two at the moment. Yeah. In favor of Demon. So this is going to be horribly confusing. Even though it's quite simple. Yeah, let's just... <laughs> well, we're not all mathematicians here, so, no. you know. <laughs> no. You can't Who expect too much, because yeah. obviously you need your PhD to work that stuff out. Yeah, this is just why we need CZM. <laughs> okay. My goodness. And he's so low. Demon just tickling him with that LG and finally finishes off with a rocket. He's going to get Evil on the spawn, but Evil manages to get away, and he's got some nice LG defense. Um... But Demon is steering clear of that. He really wants this Mega. But Evil is just going to go right in front of him and steal it with really nice rockets. Uh, Demon did not do that much damage, and now Evil has full control. And Evil charging around the corner, trying to find LG on to Demon. Finally, he does get it. Not the most ideal of angles, but he will get some nice damage out of it. And Demon, with 38 points of health, is so low. Out comes the Machine Gun of Evil. He will pick up the frag. He took a lot of damage to do so, but the 50 is there to replenish some of that lost health. And armor as Demon gets position on Mega here. This is a nice spot for Demon. Be really careful not to take too much damage. And look at the damage from Evil. Really good. Evil with the rocket jump. Perfect play from Evil. The rocket jump was a key positional play there to win the Mega. He misses the rail and the next one. Demon is so lucky there. Either one of those rails could have just killed Demon. And... Evil's still behind by one frag. He needs one more to turn up the game. 
and he's going to find himself a demon at the 50 and demon's going to go for the engagement and i don't know how smart that was from demon to stick around there as now evil can pick up that red and he's going to have a strong position on mega which is spawning imminently and look at all the stuff that evil has to play with demon is practically a toy to be manipulated in the hands of demon uh, evil right now and evil I think he's gonna go aggressive now. He knows Demon's there, but he doesn't want to make the drop down because he knows Demon's gonna punish him with that LG, so he's doing really beautiful rockets to prevent him from getting the red. But Demon still manages to get it, but not without pain. It was a pretty good result for Demon. The uh, Evil didn't do nearly as much damage there as was, uh, was possible, I think, and he was playing for that. And Evil gonna be able to actually push Demon at the back a little bit, but Demon's still a huge threat at this Mega Health, and Evil's gonna get the Mega and Demon unable to put more punishment on him as he exits that platform. And now Evil with the Rocket Jump Up is trying to find his way again onto position, onto some angles, and Demon there finds a the mid-range once again. It's all about stack advantage at that range with LG to LG, and Demon will go for the drop as he realizes he's slightly behind on the stacks. And right here, Evil. There's a really important rail for a demon yeah. to hit. Uh, he really doesn't want to let Evil stack up right now. Uh, I think Evil's in the lead now. It's, yeah, he's in the yeah. lead by one frag. Okay, yeah. They're playing the 520, right? So, yeah. yeah. So that means that so far, Demon it's has to come back one here. frag to tie up the game. Yeah. And he gets the best spawn. Exactly. But about two minutes left. There is really Evil below. Excellent takes rocket, but rocket. he drops down and he doesn't manage to pick up that yellow, but he does double back and he's able to kill Evil, tying up the game. Now have 7-7 seven, seven away. Or, no, not really, kind of. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and Demon is still lurking below. These, these areas are really horrible. You can see Evil just gets so much easy damage, but what? look at the LG from yeah. Demon. It's perfect. Three points of health and Evil with one. One. Oh my god. Again, the Demon, if you're watching the VOD. There is nothing up for him. Uh, he is low and Demon oh, is going to take him. Yes. Every time, 4 Dang. HP. Just out of range. He <laughs> survives on 4 HP again. <laughs> Who does that? <laughs> again, every game Evil does this. It's crazy. I feel like it shouldn't be allowed. My god. So here we are. Yeah, he's just uh, taking Toxic's tactics to a whole extreme level and it, one frag in the lead yep and we're coming close to time i do believe so I do 40 believe seconds left for demon to make a frag we play until 520 i th i think so <laughs> i just double check with the sense. admin just to make sure before we get to that S point it should be 620 620 okay yeah. 620 620 yeah. Okay, 620, and Demon right here has such an advantage on the stack. Uh, 630, the admin calls, 630. Okay. So okay. Demon right now has got some time, a minute and a half, to get back that frag to tie up the game, but Absolutely. Evil, perfect engagement wow. with the LG. Oh my goodness, goes straight through for the engagement through that teleporter. So much damage exchange, 21 health for Evil, and Demon goes for that throw, and he gets his kill onto Evil, as now Demon can return to the red armor, and Evil won't be there to challenge in time, I don't think. And this will be a clean pickup, and Demon is really healthy and lands the rail. Evil knows time is of the essence and goes for the engagement. That railgun shot from Demon really secured that frag and put him out of trouble. And now Demon is one frag in the lead and a minute left in this game. Yep. He's looking pretty good to win Toxicity. And of Whoa. course, it's match point, I think, yep. for Evil. Demon has to win this, Tox, to make sure he gets to the fifth and deciding map. Yeah, that was really nice from Demon to keep it together. He hit all the clutch shots that he needed to. And he's managed to claw himself back into the lead of this game after the inconvenient restart. But uh, Evil is doing whatever he can. He has got 30 seconds left, 25 now, um, to make up four frags, or three frags. Wait. Yeah, that's going to be Two really times. difficult to do that. And if hitting second left, Demon still in the lead. Is it tied? That's a tied yeah, game. Yeah, now oh it's a tied game. So tied we are it. going into an yeah. overtime. Uh, and we have... So 8.30, 30 it will end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Overtime. Two minutes added yeah, to the clock. Two course. minutes added. <laughs> and Inns pauses. Yeah. I guess uh, why does he pause? I don't oh. know. To say overtime? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, yeah. So just confirming from the admin what we already worked out here are the yeah. math geniuses at the studio. It's good to like <laughs> make sure the players absolutely know, I guess, exactly yep. when it ends and so on. Yeah, so that's, well, that's good. After things have been Sorry. lost in translation, it is certainly necessary. And we're now we're going to head into this overtime. We have evil on the front end here. It is demon. Oh my goodness, it's so strange. <laughs> but yeah. Okay, so 8.30 <laughs> is when the overtime ends. Yep. And demon... Right now, there's no, there's no sure advantage for either player at the moment. And here we have Demon picking up that red. That definitely does give him some kind of advantage. Mega's up com in upcoming in 10. And Evil's lurking the lower parts of the map here. And with three, what, a minute and a half left in this overtime, Demon's on position for the Mega. Evil not going to be able to punish him just yet. Oh, he's going to find him. Oh, he's just spinning around Evil. He's oh. running circles around him. And that rail straight onto Demon. It's going to be very painful. It's an even stack here. These rails could be crucial. Demon misses. And evil hits. Demon going to stick around. He's so, so, so crazy to stick around there. That could have been his life over. And then with a the minute left. Incredibly risky behavior from Demon. But perhaps he's looking to take it into another overtime. And play a 10 minute and 30 second. <laughs> yeah. I'm just bragging now <laughs> with my math. Oh, field. and just <laughs> executed by the railgun of evil there. Demon. Evil one point in the lead. Demon's behind now, and he has to come back with this plasma gun, and it's not going to work. No, evil just running circles around him with that LG. Um, it's going to finish up in 30 seconds. Yeah. Demon needs three frags, and evil is looking really strong. He's defending this, the red yeah. really nicely. I'm, I'm not too sure now. And this is match point for D Evil. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just getting so uh, confused. Evil wins. Today. Evil does win, in fact. Yeah. After such a weird final. Really, uh, really weird final. Yeah. <laughs> Technically, Evil won four maps in a row, but whatever. <laughs> like, I don't know. But here you go. Th good games are called by both yeah, players. Good. That's going to be the match for Evil. Yeah. And he is the champion this week. After all those issues, we'll try and ignore that. So congratulations yeah. to Evil to uh, win despite all of the annoying things that happened and but commiserations to Demon for also having to suffer through all of that along with all the rest of us. True, true. So but the best thing about it is Demon can have his redemption on LAN next week. Mm, well, it'll be online. Or online? Oh, so I thought it'll it was... Online. <laughs> okay, my bad. No. Don't even listen to me. But Demon yeah. can get his redemption next week. That's what I said. Yep. So... <laughs> Guys, uh, on that note, we have the North American Cup coming up, of course. If you're enjoying the, the Quake live action, hit that follow button. Lend us your support if yep. you are fans of Quake. And, don't and we shall support you. Absolutely. And don't forget that you can uh, direct any questions to us, obviously, through the chat or um, uh, our Twitter accounts. And yep. uh, we're going to proceed to the North American Finals very shortly. We are indeed. So there you go. We'll close out there. We'll go to a quick break before we go into the North American Cup. And we'll be back with more Quake Love action. Of course, Rafa de Hang, 4 I think are the three biggest names. Yeah. I don't think Chance was signed up. So nope. there you go. If you want to see those guys play, play it's going to come up soon. So we'll see you after this. <laughs>